What's up, everybody? Um, we got some new bling. And a new episode. Um, today is mostly going to be a mail call video. Uh, I bought um, a bunch of stuff from a few auctions recently. I'm trying to get more um, packs to open. Um, but, you know seeing some deals along the way I can't pass those up so there's some good stuff here um, plus uh, one of the boxes has uh, Pokemon packs for the kids so you know I got to crack into this thing soon so he can open um, all right let's get started scalpel scalpel I think I know what this is most of this stuff came in the last week or so I've been uh, holding off on doing a, a mail call video until I had everything because I know I had some good stuff coming so uh, good packing nobody's cracking into this I've wanted one of these for a while it's amazing that I never got one uh, in packs or collecting along the way uh, and you know with the today's market for uh, 90s 2000 wax uh, I figured I should get it now before it gets completely out of control same thing with comics I you know you got to get the stuff now because five years from now it's gonna be double uh, and I've noticed that across the board with cards and comics for all the the key stuff key rookies cre there he is it is an Ichiro rookie. It's a 2001 Tops Ichiro rookie, and it looks okay. Looks good. I mean, I didn't pay a whole lot for it. Slight bit of weight on that corner, but this is a hard card for a 10 anyway, and this is really solid. Good centering. Good centering. I mean, except for that slight bit of weight down there this is a solid card I might get this graded I think I'm gonna get it graded all right moving along I'll put Ichiro there all right. do not bend big and flat you know what that is comics Ooh, thank you. Thank you for bidding on our auction. Uh, this is... Uh, okay. I have no idea. Alright, let's get into this. Let me get the, the invoice. I'll let you know how much I paid for this. Lot of two collector vintage Marvel Comics. Lot of four collector vintage Marvel Comics team up Spider Man. Okay. I think I know what one of them was, and it was super cheap. I could not pass it up. Alright, Marvel team up. Spider Man and Ghost Rider. I paid I paid two dollars for this. Um there is nothing nothing key here, I don't think. That's in the other lot. Oh, Marvel Team Up Spider-Man. This is the first appearance of Saturday Night Live in comics. And the only appearance of Saturday Night Live in comics. Mr. Belushi, Mr. Murray, Mr. Aykroyd. Morris, Garrett Morris, Jane Curtin. Killer Redner. I have no idea. I don't know who that is. Uh, this is cool. So first appearance, I don't think there's anything else. Yeah, first appearance of uh, Saturday Night Live in Marvel Comics for $2. Buyer premium, um, 64 cents. Not bad. I like it. 
That's a good one. Move that off to the side. Second one, you already saw it, is the first appearance of Bloodstone. I got this for uh, $4. This is a mid-grade, probably around a six, six and a half. It's not bad. Faded cover, but um, overall, pretty good. This was a really good deal. I, I was shocked. I, it was late, like 4 a.m. I think this thing went off at, and uh, I don't think anybody was paying attention because 4 bucks for this book is a really good deal. All right, next. More comics. More comics. I know you guys want me to open up sports packs, but... Comics is a big part of my life too, so we're gonna get lots of comics. Plus, all you guys are just into sports packs might learn a thing or two about what comics are doing. Because uh, if you're investing in comics, I mean, you're investing in um, sports cards, you most certainly should also think about investing in comics because they are just as popular. This is one book. One book, um, I think. One book. Yep, you can reuse that. And this is ah, this is Batman 232, first appearance of Raza Ghul or Ray Shagul, however you want to say it. Um, this is one of the finest copies I've ever seen of this book. I have three already. But this one was too good to pass up. This is, this is almost perfect. This is, for a, um, a book from the early 70s, a really, really nice copy. And I will definitely get this out to CGC ASAP, along with another bunch of books, which uh, we'll go over in a CGC submission video. But this is a really nice copy. And nines... Uh, or low nines are going for um, over a thousand dollars and I paid way way less than that way less than that um, uh, so this is a this is a good score I'm really happy with that first Razagul next uh, comics more comics This is some wrapping in the, uh, let's just get into it because I know it's got the cardboard protecting it, so I don't have to it. Let's get in there. Open with care. <laughs> Alright, paper. Alright, uh, let's tear it. Okay. I have no idea what this is. But it's packed well. Okay. Open with care. Book tape to cardboard. Okay. All right. Gentle scalpel. Go away. I know what this is. This is... Oh, there's a lot of these. There are a lot. But... So there is some speculation that... Prophet will be making an appearance in television, I think. Um, this is the variant cover, the pink cover of Prophet, first appearance. There are many, many, many copies of this, but um, it was super cheap. It was $3. So, 
Uh, you can get these in dollar bins everywhere. Go to your local comic book store. You could probably grab one for a dollar or two bucks. But, um, you know, this may be a $8 book. And after his show movie, I forgot, um, makes its debut. Uh, you know, typical Liefeld cover. But um, keep an eye out. Pink variant. Youngblood. First appearance. Another one. Uh, I know what this is, too, because it's the only comic that I ordered that I didn't get yet, so. Love these Geminis. If you're a comic seller, get them. Get a bunch of them. Geminis. These are great for shipping books. Uh, you get a free poster? What is this? I get a free book? Off in the distance. Oh, Ichiro, I'm sorry. Rocket, Raccoon, and Groot. I did not order that. Okay. Cool. Free. Free stuff. And I got two. Two. With cards? Marvel Premium. That's cool. I wasn't expecting that. You heard me talk about her before and her variant covers. I love these. These are the Peach Momoko variant covers. Uh, this is Captain Marvel 16, obviously, with a free Rocket Raccoon and Groot and free cards, which I was not expecting. I knew I got two of these, but this is another. It was super cheap. It was $10 for the two of these. Um, great deal. Uh, I don't know what I'm going to do with this, but... I'll throw a bag and a board on it, but this is really cool. Great covers. I love her art. Keep your eye on out, eye out for Peach Momoko covers. They're um, like like I said in the last video, they're lo they tend to be lower print runs. At least they were. Now because of popularity, she might just be like an art germ cover girl, and she might just be on everything. So, um, I don't know, but get them if you can, because they're gorgeous. Why not? All right, I'm going to cut this off camera because my address is front and center. This is an auction win, so it's a lot, a mix of stuff. I have no idea everything in here, but it's a, a, a mix of cards, I think. So all you guys that are bored with comics... Now we're getting into some, some cards. I got what I paid for it here. I'll let you know. That is a lot of cards. One Gonzalez. Will Clark starting lineup card. And a really rough, beat up box. The Bowman Chrome. For you guys. So we can open it. One autograph, first year base card in every box. This is um, a 2002 Bowman Chrome. Uh, let's see. Oh, this is the, uh, the the checklist. All right, so we will open that on another day. Hopefully, all the packs are in here because the box is kind of hosed. Um, 18 packs, let's see. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. Very good. There's the checklist. Alright, cool. That's for another video. We'll open these up. Okay, these little tiny lots of cards. I don't think I spent... <laughs> I don't think I spent much for these. Um... Lot 166. I paid a dollar 25 for this, and that's with uh, so with the uh, internet premium, I spent a dollar 45 for this lot of cards. There must be one. There must be one card in here that I got this for. I don't know why, because uh, Will Clark is nothing. Well, there's a Glavin rookie. There's a Glavin rookie. There's a Glavin rookie. There's a Larry Walker rookie. So all right, for a dollar 25, why not? Nothing there. Carlos Delgado, minor league card. That's not bad. That's a keeper. 
Trot Nixon. Nope. Dean Palmer. Nope. Another Larry Walker rookie. Dean Palmer. No. Oh, early Jim Tomey. That's a rookie. Jim Tomey rookie. Billy Wagner rookie. All right. Jason Kendall rookie. So, you know, not bad. That's a nice one. Larry Walker's second card. Yes. One gone rookie. Barry Larkin Classic. So for a buck twenty-five, I I think I did all right. Uh, game winner Jim Tomey, Jason Giambi USA card, and Rookie of the Year starting lineup Mark Grace. All right, so those are decent. These are you know garbage. I'll pull out the Pete Rose just because, and maybe the one gone, and I'll pull those out just because this is junk, garbage. Um, so nothing good jump all right lot 148 i bought this for with the premium six dollars and 38 cents i must have liked something six dollars and 38 cents with the auction internet premium so one gone nothing there's a palmero rookie glavin rookie larry walker rookie uh, Moises Alou, Larry Walker, that's a 91, that's a second year, Grace Rookie, Palmiro, Palmiro, that's a second year, Larry Walker Rookie, Raul Mondesi Rookie, Larry Walker, Craig Kuzmic, I have no idea who that even is, that is a Kenny Lofton, that might be something, Smoltz Rookie, Smoltz Rookie, Nobody. Sean Green, rookie. Uh, Juan Gonzalez, but fixed. Not the rever not the reverse 19. So that one is the corrected version, not 250. Phil Nevin, no. Larry Walker, Juan Gonzalez. Smoltz, smoke and heat. Rafael Palmero, 90 leaf. And another Rafael Palmero subset sweet strokes um that's closer to retail but you know there might be a couple of things in there once i actually look them up so there's i am just want to make sure um i'll pull out the one gun as a minor guy and um, maybe the mondesi the rest is poop lot 158 Internet premium. I spent five dollars and fifty-one cents on this lot. I don't know if I said, but condition seems to be pretty good on these. That's a Viscal rookie. I'm pretty sure. Second year, Messina rookie, which I couldn't pass that up. Uh, Tino, no. Sean Green rookie again, no. Knobloch, eh. Messina rookie, Messina rookie. This is why I got this. Because there were three Messina rookies. Caminiti rookie. Nothing. Alex Ochoa, nothing. Hideo Nomo, Smoke and Heat. Pokey Reese, 91 draft pick. Aw. Todd Green. Yamil Benitez, no. Chuck Finley, no. Barosius is a rookie, no. Alex Fernandez, he threw a no hitter in his rookie year. Never amounted to much more. Jeff Abbott. Sean Green. Eric Gagne. Rookie. What happened to him? Joe Nathan. Was that Chris Benson? Carl Pavano. And Orion Klesko. Is that upper deck? 94. Oh, there's more. One more. <laughs> Shawan Dunstan, 97 Pinnacle. All right. Not bad. I'm going to actually go over all this again. Uh, just to make sure I'm, I'm okay with the pricing. And that's it. And that box of Bowman. That box of Bowman I paid, in case you want to know, 60 bucks. I have no idea if that's good or not. We'll find out. Oh, this is the big box. Uh, I'll cut this open off camera, but... Big box. I think... 
um, including my son's six Pokemon packs or five Pokemon packs that I got them. There's a lot of wax in here, I think. Once again, this is too good to pass up. Oh, yeah. Invoice. Oh, yeah. Lots of wax. Oh, this is going to be fun. Alright. Alright, I'm going to put this down low. Everything's shrink wrapped too, so I'm going to need a minute. But that's good. I'm glad. I'm rather it shrink wrapped than not. So, I bought this. Um, with the buyer premium. And this is purely for entertainment because there's really nothing in these sets worth worth getting crazy about. But I'm having fun, so we're just we're gonna open up some stuff. So I bought this for nine dollars. <laughs> Eighty-eight down rest. There's nothing in here. Uh, yeah, this is too early even for Elite, so there's really nothing in here. But, um, yeah. $9? $9? $9. $88. $9. Next. I have no idea what this is. We'll do that last. This is cards. We'll do that later. Okay, I've always wanted to. Oh, I've never, I've never opened this set before. This is kind of cool. This is really, this is cool. Oh, come on, they're getting bored. Open it. Alright, I got this with the buyer's premium for $36, hey six tops, that's cool, I've always wanted to open up a box of 86 tops, hopefully this is not resealed, fingers crossed. I don't think it is. That's cool. 86 times. Alright, next. This one's really cool. I, this, um, when I had my baseball card business with my dad, these are the first boxes of wax that we broke, or first cases that we started buying. So I'm very familiar with this product. And I opened a lot of it, but I, this is one of, hands down, one of my favorite sets of all time, and that is 87 Donruss. I love this set so much. 87 Donruss, I bought this for 40 bucks, um, and I'm so excited to open these up. Yeah, that's going to be fun. All right, one more, one more uh, wax box. This is a rack box. Great deal on this. I was kind of surprised. I got this for $20. This is a rack box. Of 87. 87 tops, rack box. 20, no. Oh, with the buyer premium. $27. That's a good deal. I think it's a good deal. That's so cool. Like I said, with 87 Dunruss, this is the first year that I was in, um, we had a baseball card business. So I opened up a lot of 87 tops, a lot of 87 Dunruss, and um, a fair amount of 87 Fleer. 87 Fleer was expensive when we were starting out, so we didn't get a whole lot of it. Um, but we definitely opened a lot of these too, 87 Dunruss and 87 tops. I'm so excited to open those. 
Okay, next. Um, this is... Oh. <laughs> Alright, you're going to laugh at this. I spent... <laughs> I spent, with the buyer's premium, $4 for this. And... <laughs> it is, uh... <laughs> It is drink coasters, Yankee, Yankee, Yankee drink coasters. I don't know why, they just look cool for four bucks. Um, yeah, so I had to have them. That's kind of cool though, Yankee drink coasters. Alright, um... Wait, is that, what is this? Is this wax in here? This, this is wax. They just packaged it in a in a cardboard box. Oh, this was. Oh, 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 oh. that's what this is. I see 90 Fleer, and I was like, 90 Fleer tops is not worth $32, but 90 Fleer basketball is. Oof, those are in rough shape. These are dusty and dirty. Hopefully the cards are in okay condition. So this is 1990 Fleer basketball, uh, 30... 28 packs for $30. I think I overpaid a little bit, but, you know, Jordan. You know, Jordan. And I get a free box. Alright, I'm going to move that aside. Last but not least, I spent too much for this. $27 for 20, 20 Michael Jordan cards. I have no idea... I'm just buying Jordan because I can buy Jordan and I should buy Jordan but uh, yeah I don't know 89 all-star uh, I have no idea what is this 91 hoops 91 Fleer 91 Fleer all-star 91 was that hoops 91 hoops this is probably also 91 hoops. Yes. Magic versus Jordan. Jordan Malone. 91, 92. This card keeps popping up. That's the best court card in this um, in this group. That is a 1988 Michael Jordan All Star, and it's not bad centering. It's a little little rough um, top to bottom, but this card. Um, made it all worthwhile and then this is 90 Fleer I think there's was there two of them in there double sleeved oh no there's two sleeves so I got the um, 90 90 hoops all-star and the Fleer 90 Jordan so here's uh, inside stuff what was that that's a 90 hoops that's a 90 hoops 92 hoops, I'm sorry. That's a 90 hoops. Yes. And there's two there. 9091. This is the first year of Upper Deck. And this is kind of a ripoff of the Stars card. I have no idea what this is. It's just a throw in. But this card and the uh, 1990 Fleer. And the 1990 hoops is, is a little a little less. This is not as not as uh, what's the 89 hoops? I don't know how much that one goes for. I know this card goes for in mint mint gem mint, which this is not bad. They're going for like 60 bucks. Gem mint tens are going for over 200, but this you know in a high nine or nine, this is going for like 45 50 dollars. So we got that. Uh, I gotta look. I gotta look that one up. Eighty-nine hoops is not as much as Fleer, though. That's for sure. 
And these are everywhere. 89, North Carolina, Jordan, Coca-Cola. All right, but either way, for as little as I paid, I think it was worth it. To These, these Jordan cards, because of Last Dance, they're just going up and up and up. So, scalpel. These are my big ones from the auctions, minus who knows what's going to be in the packs. Hopefully something good. Maybe we'll get a Gem Min 10, I don't know, 86. Cecil Fielder rookie. <laughs> All right, cool. Um, so that's it. Signing off. Um, like and subscribe. Come back for more. I think now that the uh, the mail calls are done, it's uh, pack opening time on a lot of stuff. So uh, we'll get to that. All right. Thank you. And uh, see you next time.